Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name is Brianna and this is Four Paws in a Book. I make book and lifestyle related content so if that's something that you're interested in, make sure that you hit that subscribe button down below. Today we're going to go book shopping. So it's been a while since I've done a book shopping vlog. I say a while. It's been a bit. Okay, I don't know how long it's been. Two months maybe? Anyways, not important. <laughs> I'm actually at a new Barnes & Noble uh, that I've never been to because it's on the opposite side of town from where I normally am. Um, and we're gonna go to it uh, because I've, again, never been here. So their BOGO tables might be fantastic. We don't know. Um, I don't have anything that I specifically want um, or like need specifically um, that I like have in mind, but we're just gonna see what they have. So let's go. On your own, it's hard to find The difference between truth and lies Your heart will fool you every time The difference between you and me Is I don't trust in what I see when the times get harder, I get a little smarter. And I don't see the difference between truth and love. The difference is the way the words are spun. The lines are only blurring with your eyes half shut. But stop me if you think I'm playing God. Playing God Carefully you tow the line To see what's on the other side You and all of humankind The difference between love and love Stop me if you think I'm playing God Playing God oh, yeah. Playing God yeah. oh. It doesn't really matter that you made mistakes All that matters is you take your steps to change Between truth and love The difference is the way the words are spun The lines are only blurry with your eyes half shut But stop me if you think I'm playing I don't see the difference between truth and love Stop me if you think I'm playing God You're so 
From Below by Darcy Coates. A lot of people have been talking about about Darcy Coates over the horror spooky season. Um, a lot of my friends have been. And Cassidy from Covers with Cassidy just recently read this one. And a lot of the things that she said about that book, even though like she didn't give that book five stars or anything like that, a lot of the things that she said about it really were buzzwords for me. Underwater horror has a lot um, of similarities to like sci-fi space horror and I really like that because it gets really psychological. You're really like you're dealing with elements and like not sure if your brain is working properly or if it's the lack of oxygen whatever. Um, so I'm really excited about this. I haven't read a underwater horror in a very long time so um, really excited about this. Will I get it done before the end of spooky season? We don't know. Um, <laughs> you're actually gonna be seeing this after spooky season so I guess you know. Um, but anyway, thank you for watching. Uh, if you are new here and you have not yet subscribed, there's a little red button that you can do so down below the video. If you'd like to hang out with me more, the links to my Instagram, Goodreads, Twitter, and my Patreon are all linked down below. You can check me out there. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye. Just can't seem to close my eyes and sleep. I'm locked inside this day.